right. All right, we're here with uh, IBA Continental America's champion, uh, and Sergio Tainushain Perales. Sergio, uh, you just uh, knocked your opponent out in the sixth round. How do you feel right now, man? Man, I feel real good. I feel tired. This guy, uh, he gave me, he gave me a good run. You know, it's what I needed—a good test uh, to see where I stand and what kind of level of fighter I am. I mean. I can deliver punches, and I, I, uh, today I, I think I proved that I could, I could take punches too because uh, he can crack the guy. The guy threw a good punches, and uh, he caught me a couple times that, that I had to retreat on my attack because uh, I was a little stunned, but just uh, uh, I collected myself and just got back at it because I'm here for to win. Okay, now the opponent that you just beat is the WBC uh, Latino Federation champion. Uh, you know, obviously this is going to move you up in the rankings now. You know, how do you feel about that? Oh, man, it's a good start to a new year. Uh, it's a good start to a new year. I hope... Uh, we have more fights like this throughout the year because uh, that's what I want. You know, I want to move up in the rankings and be mentioned among the best fighters because uh, I feel like uh, I'm at that level that I can I can compete amongst the best. And uh, I still got a lot to learn, though. I still got a lot to learn. We got to get back in the gym, work on mistakes I do. Uh, got to collect myself. Robert, uh, he gets after me, man, because I want to get into the bra and, and I want to exchange punches when I can make it an easier fight, you know, just staying away because from the outside while I was jabbing, the guy, was uh, he wasn't going to touch me. But um, I try to go for the stop when uh, when I should be a little bit more careful. If, if it comes, it comes instead of going out for it. But it was a good test, and uh, I uh, take my hat off to this guy. He gave a, a good match. Okay, now you have a bright future ahead of you. But as your uh, your team, uh, even your trainer Robert Campos, was uh, hoping maybe by the end of the year, uh, hopefully uh, fighting for a world title. You know what would that mean to you? That's what we're looking for, man. That's what we're in the business for to be the best and. Uh, to go after a world title, man, it's, it's going to be a dream come true. Just go out there and give it my best, and hopefully it comes my way. All right, so bring it to Brownsville, dude. Oh, yeah, bring it to the real Grand Valley, you know. in Brownsville. All right. Uh, is there anything else you want to say, Sergio, before we close to MyUniversalSports.com? Man, I thank everybody for coming out, all the support we get here in the Valley. Just Not just myself, but all the other fighters, Robert, Tigre, Jerry. He's an upcoming fighter from our gym. That's, he's a uh, man. He's as good as they get, too. So. Uh, thanks everybody for coming out and uh, and uh, I hope to see y'all there at the next show. Okay, Sergio, thank you. Thank you, man.